And hello wherever you're watching, welcome to North London. I'm Derek Ray and adjacent to me in the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Tottenham Hotspur up against Newcastle United. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. And the starting 11 for Spurs. Well, I think they have a nice balance to their team. A solid back four, two holding midfielders, three creative players in advance of them, and a mobile centre forward. It's a good team. And here's the Newcastle formation. Well, it's great to see a team playing with wingers in a 4-3-3, but they've got to be effective, both with their dribbling and their crosses. Otherwise, they'll become bit-part players. Thank you. Enjoy the game. And this confrontation is underway. Anthony Gordon. And the Magpies finding space on the flank. Delivered into the box. Full box to the keeper. Well, what a reaction from the goalkeeper. Such a good save in the end. the short one well that'll be a free kick and deep into the penalty area I'll tell you what that is really top class defending Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Chances on. And a goal! 1-0, and what a fast start they've made to this game. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Well, Newcastle United get the ball moving again. Can they come up with a response now? Bisuma. Spurs moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? And teammates to play it to. Will it be? Oh, tremendous goal! Technical excellence to finish that one off. Wonderful to have that in your repertoire. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box. Just begging someone to get on the end of it. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal.
So back underway with the scoreline standing at 2 0. Bissouma has it. Uh, Newcastle come away with it. Almiron. Guimaraes. And now can he keep calm? And the ball is loose. Cleared away comprehensively. And a Tottenham Hotspur free kick coming up. Really good challenge. Guimaraes. Miguel Almiron. And it's with Isaac. And what a magical save it was! Well, he's so frustrated, isn't he? It's another wasted opportunity. Keen to take it short here. Almiron. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Kulusevsky. Brennan Johnson. There to win it back. Miguel Almiron, Guimaraes, using his physical strength to shield it, can he convert? Well, fantastic reflex action from the goalkeeper. Short it is. Not the best challenge, free kick. Delivered into the box and still a chance. And in! The second time of asking, just what was required. Well, here we can see it again. Normally, I'm the first to point the finger at a goalkeeper, but I think it's a good initial save. I'm not sure he could have done much more. Just a bit unfortunate, really, that it dropped to an opponent. So back underway, Newcastle certainly back in the contest. What next? Son, in with a chance! Oh, magical piece of goalkeeping! Well, he's just pulled off a great save there. Such good reactions, it really is.
Who can they pick out? And the keeper dealt with the danger. Son. Just the challenge that was required. Bodies forward and the break looks on. It is a decent looking attack here. Oh, fine play, and maybe it'll set something up. And far from the ideal cross. Keeper's ball all the way. And getting close to the half-time interval with Spurs holding the advantage. Stuart, interested to know what strikes you about their performance. Yeah, it's certainly been an open game, but on the balance of play, I think they do deserve their lead. They just have that little bit more creativity, particularly in the wide areas. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. And the counter looks on here, options available. The electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. Well, there's a really stylish piece of running. And he favours the inside routes. Song! And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, not quite the corner he had in mind. Goalkeeper has it. And so it is. The first half story has been written. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Yeah, he's played pretty well, to be fair. He's looked confident and assured on the ball. But he's going to need a helping hand if they are to turn this around in the second half. So, the ball rolling again, Newcastle trailing after the first half, and they come up with a response here in the second. Well, nothing for them to worry about in the end, good defending. Giovanni Lo Celso. And the ball back with Newcastle here. Well time tackle. And support available. Oh, this is looking promising. And a goal it is for Tottenham Hotspur. Well on course for victory here. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder, and it's a great finish. He holds off the defender, keeps his composure, and finds the back of the net. It's a marvellous goal. Well, back to the drawing board, I'm afraid. His team have been really poor today. So on with the action, and 3-1 the scoreline at the moment. Fabian Scher. Isaac. Joel Linton. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. This looks more than decent. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. It did look on for them, but not to be. Counter-attacking possibilities. Almiron. Now, this could really lift spirits. Oh, did so well to deny him. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. An 
over it comes and swept out of there Rebier Rebier a chance to whip it in takes the shot and what a magical save it was short corner. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. Bruno Guimaraes. Well, Spurs with the ball again. Is it going to end up being productive for them? And threading it through. Bisuma, terrific block there. Well, he would have been disappointed had he spilled that one. Delightful pass. And the corner has been given. And a change for Spurs at this juncture. Who can they pick out? Still not clear. Nicely blocked. And the referee felt he had to blow the whistle. towards the far post but it wasn't quite as good as it looked when it left the boot Newcastle regaining possession here oh good looking run fine goalkeeping to push that away well that might have given us an interesting finish but the goalkeeper has done really well there. This might be ideal for the counter. Oliver Skip. And now with Kulusevski. He could pick out a teammate. Forcing him. And a goal! If there were any remaining doubts, that will settle the issue. Well, just look at this. He's so alive to the situation. That's a neat-headed goal in the end. Well, that's not a happy manager. He knows he's got a lot of work to do now. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Isaac. And the referee allowing advantage to accrue to them. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. Well, that's common sense refereeing to play advantage. Superb block. Oliver Skip. Now Son. And the referee is going to add on four added minutes. Now, can they hit them on the counter? A Spurs free kick it's going to be. The play was allowed to carry on, but now that it's come to a halt, a caution.
here it is now, a substitution. Now the attack fizzled out. Pierre, oh, managing to beat him, and a fine stop. It is. And deciding to cross here, Son just can't get it past him. And the referee blows his whistle. It's full time here, and Spurs have prevailed. Your assessment? Well, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? I was particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively, almost cutting through at will at times. The result was never much in doubt, if I'm honest. Well, we're picking him out for a reason. He's had a tremendous game and attack, Stuart. Well, he was a major reason why they won today. He was so reliable and he inspires those around him.